you know, as it is unashamedly a faith-based website, the content there is not just going to cover the issues of faith, but it's going to cover the current events of media. How do Christians find themselves dealing with current events from a faith-based perspective? And what are some of the things that they can uh, do on a daily basis at the stream that will help them interact in the daily world? Well, one thing they can do is pass the... Uh comments and the commentaries on to others and get people going there. It should become a daily news source. Just like what you have done this morning, uh, I found myself saying I want to try to capture Pastor Hagee's remarks and see if we can't get them on the stream today. Please bear in mind, if you'll just look at my welcome to the stream, you'll find that we are, we're in development stages. It's amazing where we are right out of the gate. And the response has been overwhelming that this could become the number one most visited news site and website perhaps of all time. And that would be wonderful because what we're doing is we are bringing together people who love God, who understand that we are created in His image, that we don't have any challenge or any obstacle that we can't overcome or deal with. When people created in the image of God, take what God has given to us and utilize it wisely. But we also have to understand that the way we will be effective and bless everyone is to love God and then love our neighbor. So what we're trying to do is show people what it looks like in the public forum. If Christians would become the light that cannot be hidden, refuses to be, if we stand together as believers in the foundational truths and the principles of the Word of God, we become a shining city set on a hill that cannot will not and must not be hidden. And then we become a salt effect, protecting the precious. And in this stream will enlighten, inform, excite, and bring people together to stand against the forces of evil.